In this video, I will be going over an example on how to pick out the linearly independent vectors of a set. So let's say that we have the following vectors, v1 all the way to v5, and they are defined as written. And we want to pick out which vectors are linearly independent. So all we have to do is we throw these vectors into a matrix. So here I have v1, v2, v3, v4, and v5 all in, inside a matrix and then I row reduce it in order to find the pivot columns and so in a previous video I, I showed the same matrix and I showed how to find the pivot columns so I'm going to skip that step and we showed that it was row equivalent to this matrix which is the REF the row echelon form of the matrix and we were able to pick out the pivot columns as the first non-zero entries in each row. So these guys are, are pivots where the corresponding columns are columns 1, 2, and 5. So this means that the first, second, and fifth vectors of our original matrix are linearly independent. The first, second, and fifth vectors are the linear independent set where these two guys right here v3 and v4 are linearly dependent which means they must be combinations of v1 v2 and v5 so our answer is simply v1 v2 and v5